Hi, my name is Henry Mosley, Project Coordinator for Home Care Suites. Today I'll be showing you our latest model. This particular unit was custom designed for our clients to meet their budget and goals. Of course, we'd be more than happy to tailor and custom design a unit for you. Also, this unit was built in unincorporated Pinellas County, where the maximum square footage is 500 square feet. All cities and counties have their own individual zoning ordinances. So contact us and we'd be happy to provide a free consultation for your local zoning jurisdiction. So if you're ready, we'll go get started. This is a slab on grade foundation. The process for this is we dig footers, we form a stem wall, we fill with inorganic dirt, and then we pour a four inch monolithic slab concrete pour on top of that. The elevation of this will be determined by your FEMA flood zone map. Um, it typically matches the finished floor elevation of your primary structure, but if you're not sure, just give us a call and we'll uh, be happy to explain it to you. The framing of the unit is traditional 2x4 stick frame construction. Of course, this meets all the Florida building codes and is designed to withstand the high velocity winds during a hurricane. The unit has a concrete hardy board siding. The benefit to this product is that it's impervious to water and insects, which are both a huge problem here in Florida. Also, it gives the cottage that beach cottage feel. We can match the architectural features of your primary home, and in fact, some, some municipalities require that. Again, you can contact us and we can provide you those zoning ordinances for that. The roof is a 5V metal galvalume roof. This roof comes with a 25 year warranty because it's so durable. Also, again, we can customize this roof to match the architectural features of the existing home, whether that's tile, uh, shingles, or metal like this one. The unit is equipped with a 24,000 BTU LG mini split system. This product is very energy efficient with a high sear rating. It functions like a central AC system with ductwork in the attic. It's also whisper quiet. Here we have a 100 amp electrical sub panel box. This panel connects to the main electrical grid, the primary structure. Also the sewer and water are connected to the primary structure. For the windows, we install a low E double glazed high impact window. Again, the Florida Building Code requires that these windows be able to withstand high velocity winds. They're also extremely energy efficient. To further enhance the energy efficiency of the cottage, we use the Nicenine spray foam insulation. Not only will this reduce your energy bill, it'll reduce the noise. All right, so walking inside, we first step into the living room and kitchen area. You can see it's a nice, big, open room. Um, shared space between the kitchen and the living room. Um, over here in the living room, we have uh, an area for an entertainment system, um, a couch and a recliner, and of course, we take advantage of the beautiful pool view. Walking over back to the kitchen, we have a island bar top with seating for three bar stools. Again, more seating space in the unit. Um, in the kitchen, we have a full-size refrigerator a stove top, um, and custom cabinetry completely designed by the homeowner. So making our way into the living room, we have some space for um, a food pantry. We have a linen closet. You know, um, storage space is important, so we make sure to include these features in our units. Now making our way into the bedroom, we have a, this is a 11 by 12 floor plan. So it's enough room for a king, but maybe just a queen. We also have a washing machine and stack dryer over here. Um, this was a custom request by our client to be able to do this. See this. This is gonna be a sliding glass door um, to cover and, and uh, cover up the, the unit. So making our way into the bedroom, or the bathroom. Again, um, we customized this for our client to make it a walk-in shower. Um, we got a towel rack in here. Uh, we're also putting in a custom seat for our client as well. 
cabinetry matches the kitchen cabinetry. Um, but we will custom design anything that you like. Also, we have a walk-in closet. So enough space to put all your, your uh, Florida clothes in here. So now we'll talk about all the places that we can customize our suite. Here in the kitchen, you can see that the clients uh, built their own set of cabinets. This was specially designed for this unit. We will provide as many door options and finish options as possible. Here you can see some of the, the cabinet door options that we've provided for this unit. You have the white one, which is what they ended up going with. And you also have uh, a classic wood finish. It's also different sample sizes or style finishes. We will do the countertops for you as well. You can see our client went with a granite countertop in here. And uh, this is the sample board that we gave her to choose which style she wanted to go with. So here are the vinyl plank options. We can also provide you with tile, carpet, or hardwood flooring options as well. For the lighting fixtures, we have an allowance in our budget and our clients will typically go to Home Depot or Lowe's and select the fixtures that they like. We'll do the installation for you. For the interior next to your paint colors, we'll provide our clients with a sample wheel. Once they've selected a couple samples, we'll go and procure the samples and put them on the wall for our clients to make a final decision. Well, that just about wraps it up for us. Thanks again for touring the Backyard Cottage, and we hope you're excited about building one for your property. Remember, starting is easy. It all begins with finding out the rules for accessory dwelling units for your property. So contact us today, and we'll be happy to provide that information. Thanks again.